I want to try to quickly go over how I modified my Windows PowerShell prompt to show information from Git. And basically, if I'm in a folder that's being tracked by Git, you'll see the word Git, you'll see the branch that I'm currently on, and then you'll see some summary information about the current status. And basically what this is, is if I do a Git status, you get a more verbose uh, output of, on the current status of how many files are new in the git index, how many files are modified, and files that it might be untracked. But if you do a git status and add a porcelain argument, you'll get a much more succinct output and it'll show you the status of your working folder in relation to your git repository. And what happens is there's these two character codes that come out and you can actually find, if you go to the uh, git status man page, scroll down a bit, you can actually see what the letters mean, and then it shows you the um, different combinations of the, the codes and what they mean. The left side is the status of your git index, and the right side shows the status of the file in your working folder. So, in this case, this particular file has been added to my git index, these files here have been modified in my drive but are not in the git index and these particular files here are not tracked. So what I did is basically I took the output of this command, parsed out this information, and then summarized it on the prompt. Um, basically the way to customize the prompt is you create a file called profile.ps1 and this PowerShell script it needs to go into your libraries, documents, and then Windows PowerShell folder. Um, it also could be in your home directory and it'll be under um, my documents. It ends up that's the same directory as your libraries documents. Um, I ended up having to create this Windows PowerShell folder myself and then I threw this profile.ps1 file into the folder. Now there may be other ways to get this in there but uh, th this is how I did it. And this contains a function called prompt and this uh, modifies your, your prompt for your Windows PowerShell. I got the shell of the script from a post on Stack Overflow and what I did is I just kind of modified the guts of it and I get the uh, git status with the, the porcelain output and then I go ahead and use some regular expressions and use a hash table and roll up that information and then it gets output to the prompt. Um, and I'll go ahead and I'll put the script up on my blog at thethoughtfulcoder.com and basically if you're in a folder that's not being tracked by a Git repository, you'll see this particular prompt. It'll be green and it just says PS over here. And then as soon as you're in a folder that's tracked by Git, then you'll get some summary information up here. And you'll s it really helps when you're working with Git at the command line to kind of know what branch you're on and what's the status of the repository. And I, I really like this uh, information on my prompt. So hopefully this helps someone out. Uh, take care.